today. I'm joined here with Becca from the SPCA and she's brought in Moon, this adorable dog just full of energy and uh, just loves being around people. <laughs> yeah. um, so we were talking a little bit of off camera about how she came to the SPCA. Um, yeah. It's kind of a sad story. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so she was just left in our playpen at night kind of thing. Uh, so it was just kind of by chance that I showed up and seen her in there. So I took her in before it started to rain and stuff mm -hmm. like that. But uh, I mean, uh, you know, initially she was quite timid and shy and, you know, really wasn't too, too yeah. trusting of everybody. But then, you know, it didn't take her long to show her puppy side <laughs> and show her that she loves absolutely everything that she encounters. Yes. She's very much, uh, she loves kids. Like she, oh, perfect. I, she, like I said, she needs a little bit more training in that because like she's very much like when she starts licking their face, yeah. like she will keep going until <laughs> they yeah. fall down and things like that. But she's still like, fairly gentle things like that like she just yeah. needs a little bit more training <laughs> and she's still a puppy so yeah. she'll yeah. obviously need that kind of training so she yes. says she, you say that she's very good with kids so you'd recommend a family with any really oh, any yeah. age yeah any age like I said I mean if, if you have like young young kids and you you think that you might not have the time to train her then obviously right like take yeah. that into <laughs> take that into mind right but um, yeah uh, I mean, if you have the time to, you know, work with her and train her and everything, she it would be a fantastic family dog. And have you noticed <laughs> her w around other animals or like dogs or cats? Yeah, she seems like with the dogs for sure, she kind of really doesn't bark too much or anything at them. She kind of keeps to herself in her kennel. Um, I think that she probably would enjoy a nice little play group with another fun dog. Yeah. Um, so I think if you if you have another dog, definitely bring it for a meet and greet. I don't see too many issues. Mm -hmm. Like I said, she can be kind of timid and shy still. So I think if she would be a little bit more of the submissive dog kind of thing yeah. too. So <laughs> <laughs> and very cuddly yes. as well. <laughs> yeah, no, she's very loving and very open to yeah. jumping on people. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. Just so obviously, this, you know, <laughs> I, it's nice, but yeah, yeah. needs a little bit more training. Oh, definitely. <laughs> and uh, this past weekend, you had set the adoption fee for adult cats at $25. Yeah, yeah. We were mentioning that it was pretty successful. Yeah, yeah. We adopted out 13 of our adult cats. So that was nice. We kind of set a little bit of a goal with ourselves for at least to uh, adopt out 10. My goodness, honey. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, so we found 13 homes, uh, 13 homes for 13 new cats kind of thing. Yeah. Um, for, yeah, by the end of the day yesterday. It was like right right at 6 o'clock we did another adoption. So Whoa. it was good. Yeah, we yeah. got we got them done. So we're still quite full mm -hmm. of kittens and things like that. So we're going to get them all uh, good to go, you know, yeah. spayed and neutered and everything like that. But, I mean, they're all, the lots of them are up for viewing. So if you're looking for a new little kitten friend, then definitely come okay. check out what we got. And you do you still have adult cats? Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, like a lot of them are not, like we don't have a lot <laughs> left, <laughs> but uh, the ones we do have are kind of like the moms of the litters and things like that. Uh, so we have the few left that are just kind of hanging out with their babies still. <laughs> yeah, which is, which is nice. Oh, she's, she's just so loving. Yeah. She would make a perfect dog for any yeah. family. Oh my goodness. Come on. Is there any, um, events coming up uh, in the near future? Uh, no, we don't have anything too, too pressing coming up or anything like that. Like I think right now we're really just concentrating on trying to find uh, all of our animals some yeah. homes. We still have lots of dogs too. I mean, we did five dog mm -hmm. adoptions last week as well. It was a really good week. Even if we didn't adopt out those 13 cats, yeah. we still, all together, we did 25 adoptions. Oh, so perfect. it was it was a good week for animals. So Yeah, no kidding. That's yeah. awesome. <laughs> uh, well, thank you so much for yeah. coming in and bringing in Moon. She's, yeah. She would <laughs> honestly make any home just that much more yes, happier and better yes. so <laughs> I really hope that she gets adopted really soon yes so us too <laughs> yeah thank you thank you